This is 17th video of 8051 theories. My name is Milan Shah and today's topic is Interrupt Register. Now 8051 has two 8 bit interrupt register. First is IE and second is IP. So this is the IE stands for Interrupt Unable Register. It is 8 bit register. It is bit or byte addressable. Its address is A8H. It is used to enable and disable function of interrupts. So now let's see the EA bit. EA bit is used to disable all interrupts. Now if EA is equal to 0 then no interrupt is acknowledged. And if EA is equal to 1 then each interrupt source is individually enabled or disabled by setting or clearing its enable bit. So if you want to enable the interrupts then we have to enable EA bit. Now the 6th bit is used for future means it is reserved. Now 5th bit is ET2. It enables or disables timer to overflow or capture interrupt. Now ET1 is 3rd bit. It is used to enable or disable timer 1 overflow interrupt. So this is the timer 1 overflow and this is the timer 2 overflow. Enable or disable. Now ES. ES is used to enable or disable the serial port interrupts. Serial port interrupts are RI or TI. So it is used to enable or disable them. Now EX1 is used to enable or disable external interrupt 1 means INT1 and EX0 here is used to enable or disable external interrupt 0 means INT0 now ET0 is used to enable or disable timer 0 overflow interrupt means TF0 so this is used to enable or disable timer 0 this is used to enable or disable timer 1 and this is used to enable or disable timer 2. So that's all here. Do like, share, subscribe or comment below. And thanks for watching.